Yesterday I went to the British Museum and took loads of photos and I came across this. It was quite a happy accident and so I thought I'd talk about it. This is a bit of a better photo because you can see more of what I'm going to talk about. But to start with, this is a Mycenaean bowl and it dates to around 1300 BC and it was found on the island of Crete. And what you've got there is you've got an oxen and you've got an egret. And apparently the two often are found together and the seems like the egret is pecking something off the back of the ox. When I was looking at the bowl, I couldn't stop looking at the bowl. I was actually really, really, I would say connecting it. That sounds a bit pretentious, but I'm sure you understand what I mean when you just have something with a, with an item, with a, with a piece in a museum. And certainly this was the case. And I think it's because the image seems so sincere. So you might imagine sometimes with vases and pottery and stuff, the thought that the artist is just trying to fill a space. But here I think that's not the case at all. They're actually trying to connect to a scene, to something they perhaps saw in real life earlier that day or that week. Not something I think that was necessarily taken from memory. I think this feels like a, like a real life event. And you can see the kind of interaction there between the two creatures, particularly how the eyes line up. That's really, really quite beautiful. And then you've also got the different textures that the ox has. Again, that allows the artist to showcase their skill. Now, this isn't a mythical scene. This is something I imagine many people of the time saw and probably do today. And therefore, that brings with it something else. It brings with it a sensation. You can imagine seeing this and immediately thinking, yeah, I've seen something similar. And you start imagining where you saw it, the uh, the landscape, the sounds, everything. And so it's it's a beautiful image because it's not just about the two creatures. It's about an entire context and the sort of the sound, the smells, the sight of where they were. And again, perhaps I'm overthinking it, but I think the artist caught that brilliantly. I don't think for a moment that this was just manufactured out of memory. I think this was something they'd actually seen. But that's just my thoughts. Perhaps I'm over-egging it. What do you think?